get away. Hey. Hey. How come you're at home? You're not out with Mr. Wonderful, Mr. Gorgeous, Mr. Million Dollars a Year. Joe and I broke up. When? Monday. You mean Joe's available? Oh, God. Oh, bad friend. Oh, I'm so sorry. You still must be so upset. I'm sorry. I'm not upset. We've been growing apart for quite some time. But you were a couple. You were together. You had someone to go places with. You had a date on national holidays. I said to myself, you deserve better than this. You're 31 and... and the clock is ticking. The clock doesn't start to tick till you're 36. God, you're in such great shape. Well, I've had a couple days to get used to it and um, I'm okay. Good. Then you're ready. <laughs> I've got the perfect guy. Marie, I'm not ready yet. Well, you just said you were over him. I am over him, but I'm in a mourning period. Who is it? Alex Anderson. Oh, you fixed me up with him six years ago. He's got that chin situation. Oh, that's right. You got a thing about chins. Okay, save him for me. Ah, okay. Here we go. Ken Darman. He's been married for over a year. Really? Married? Dead to me. Oh, wait a minute. I got it. Here we go. This Look. is it. Look, there's no point in me going out with someone if I might really like him, if I met him at the right time, but right now has no potential of being anything to me but a transitional man. Okay, okay. But don't wait too long. You remember David Warsaw? His wife left him, and everybody said, give him time, don't move in too fast. Six months later, he was dead. What are you saying? I should marry someone right away in case he's about to die? At least you could say we're married. Huh. I wonder if he's still alive.